Did you know that River State is the second largest economy in Nigeria? That's according to the National Bureau of Statistics in 2015. The sacrifices and persistence of the founding fathers of River State lifted the minorities from deprivation to becoming one of the elites among the committee of states in the country. These were the words of the state governor, yes, on weekend during the inauguration of a committee set up to draw a roadmap towards a month-long activity to mark 50 years of the creation of River State. Many of us who are now enjoying the fruits of liberty may not truly really appreciate what it meant to be dominated, dispossessed, deprived, exploited and oppressed in your own land by the dominant social and political tendencies of the time. Before the state was created, our people could not find schools in their neighborhood, hospitals to treat the sick, universities to educate their children, decent jobs to earn income and good rules to their communities. However, for 50 years, we were the masters of our own destiny within the Nigerian nation, gradually and progressively building our own communities and striving to improve the quality of life in every resident. By the grace of God, River State is today not just another number in the body of states, it has become so profound in population and resources and contributing far above other states to the economic and existential interests and well-being of Nigeria.